Hey what's up everybody it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks and today I'm going to show you how to tweak the capacitive button backlight on your Galaxy S6. Now for some odd reason not all variants of the Galaxy S6 and S6 Edge have a menu option for changing the backlight timeout for their capacitive buttons. From what I've read I believe only the AT&T variant of these phones has such an option and that's definitely strange. But thanks to an app from the developer Not Quite Insane, the button backlight settings can be adjusted on all models of the S6 now. Even better, this app doesn't require root access, so there's no restrictions on who can use this. To get started, head to the Play Store and search Galaxy Button Lights. Then when you have the app installed, go ahead and open it up and we'll see what it's all about. It has a very straightforward interface. In fact, it's a lot like what the stock options on the AT&T variant would look like. You have three options here. You can set the backlights to come on briefly, then fade away after a preset time, which is the stock setting. But this slider here lets you adjust the timeout period, so you can make the lights stay on longer or have them go dim even quicker. Or if you'd rather the lights not dim out at all, select the second option and they'll stay on at all times. The third option is the complete opposite of that. Select this one to make sure your button backlights are always off. But when you have the settings configured to your liking, tap the save button at the bottom of the screen. At this point your button backlights will immediately start using their new settings and you don't have to do anything else. As a matter of fact you can even uninstall the app after you set the button backlights to your liking and the settings will remain in effect. So it's an incredibly easy way to regain functionality that was mysteriously absent on most Galaxy S6 variants. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks. But until then, happy gadget hacking.